A question that I get a lot is how do you uh, convince people that service design is a thing which is good for customers and for business. And what I often see happen is that people try to make a lot of logical arguments for why this is the case. Uh, basically, they're trying to convince somebody why they should pursue service design. And although I get it why people think that makes sense, but in a lot of cases quite um, ineffective. If you think about, for instance, any other thing, like uh, things you might pursue, uh, let's say a diet, a paleo diet, you don't get into a paleo diet, you don't get excited about it like from, from day one. From, uh, if you're not into uh, a healthy lifestyle, healthy living, um, those kind of things, you probably won't be interested in a paleo diet no matter what somebody says to you. So um, stuff like that grows on you. It has to be in your field of interest. Now, how do you do that? Um, Usually it happens through very small um, experiences. You do things, you read things, uh, you hear things, and then um, it grows on you. And I think with service design, it's exactly the same. I'm not sure um, why we're stepping over it, but service design has to grow on you. You have to build trust. You have to build confidence uh, with the methodology, with the mindset. Asking somebody who isn't familiar with, with this to um, accept it and understand it from an explanation in just an hour or even less, uh, I think that's a f uh, quite far shot. So I would say how to get people excited about service design, how to get buy-in for service design, it's all about uh, taking small steps, um, letting service design grow on somebody. So think about what kind of experiences you've had that helps you along your way, again, to build your confidence in service design. And maybe the biggest problem is that we're, we're impatient. We want, we're so in love with this. We're so convinced that this works and we want everybody to, yeah, to feel that way too. But we forget that we took uh, probably a pretty long road to get here as well. We didn't learn this in an hour or an afternoon. So convincing people, getting people excited about service design, take small steps, let people experience things and have patience.